Supercomputers are dominating the news cycle across the globe, isn't it? But what are they? Where does India stand in the global race? But before we get to know that, let's understand what actually a supercomputer is. Your high-end computer can handle around 500 GB of data. A supercomputer can manage millions and billions of them. Scientists use these computers to solve complicated calculations in computational chemistry, material science, quantum mechanics, etc. For example, these computers can make discovering a new drug easier. So where does India stand among its peers? No wonder then countries are ramping up their supercomputing capabilities. Unsurprisingly, China and US have most number of supercomputers. China has 173 of the world's top 500 most powerful supercomputers. The US has 128 supercomputers. Together, these two nations make around 60% of the world's most powerful supercomputers. India is really low in this list. Only three Indian-based systems have earned the seats in the list as of June 2022. Although India had started to indigenously develop its supercomputers by 1984 with institutions like BARC, CDAC, CDOT, the momentum has picked up recently. In 2015, the center launched the National Supercomputing Mission and we are seeing the results. Today, India has 23 supercomputers installed at various institutions. Of all, Param Siddhi AI is the fastest supercomputer and Param Ananta is the newest one. So what are some of the issues that are stopping the country from becoming a global leader in this space? Currently, India lacks the infrastructure to produce semiconductor devices required for the development of supercomputers. So we have to rely on imports. However, these components could have military applications. So producer nations have some export restrictions. Lack of awareness is another reason. Countries like the US, China and Japan initiated supercomputer projects decades ago and they have the first mover advantage. Now what can India do? The first thing that needs to be done is investment, capital and people. India has started building the required hardware but it is still in the early days and would need a push. India has no exascale computers yet. Work for this has already begun and we can expect an indigenously developed exascale computing system up and running by 2024.